All right, while Megan's not here, talk to me. Good, bad, legs heavy, legs tired. Like, how do we run slower here than we ran at Jekyll? I think ultimately it also shows that we do have a lot more potential as a team than we originally thought. Because even on our bad day, we still only lost by one point. Yeah, it's it's very interesting to kind of think of the the mindset of the guys team versus the girls team, especially since both of us got second. I'm really excited for Region. I think we're all going to do really well. Oh, Megan's not here. Talk to me. Good, bad, legs heavy, legs tired. Like, how do we run slower here than we ran at Jekyll? And? So, like, I'm, we lost by one point, but I watched, I don't know how many Marietta people passed you guys the last mile. Does that make sense? So, like, when we talk about, like, every place matters, we mean every place matters. Um, you got to fight for every place. They had a good day, we had a bad day, and we were still only one point behind. But I don't know. Like we got We have to. We have to execute. So I don't. I don't know. Heavy legs. Did you not want to race? Because it didn't really look like you wanted to race, especially the second half. Uh, you and Megan did not get out well, and you didn't close well either. So like, if you start conservative, you don't want to commit to the second half of your race and pass people. Then you got out in a good spot. Uh, you ran okay, but like. I mean, okay, times were slow, so times weren't as fast as I thought they would be. But like, when we look at like how we competed, we didn't compete. The boys, they competed. They were passing people. Does that make sense? So, I mean, you got to think, like, did you have a Marietta person that you could have passed in the last 800 meters? Or did a Marietta person pass you in the eight, last 800 meters? If they did, that's a two-point swing right there. Does that make sense? So, you guys are probably... You're going to be hard on yourself, so be hard on yourself. You should be, but once 24 hours pass, forget about it. Like, we're healthy. We didn't run as well as we could. We got second by one point. There's a lot that we left on the table today. Take something and learn something from this. Like, did you not get out fast enough? Did you go out too fast? Did you not care the second half? Did it hurt? Did your shoe fall off? Or did it come off or just untied the whole time? the whole time. I was trying to like, I was afraid it was going to fall off because it was like gravel. Did you stop to tie it? No. So, buddy summarized for her. We didn't have the best week, but at least we didn't compete or whatever. <laughs> no, you, we, just we didn't have the best week. We need to learn from this. Yeah. Losing, look, I don't necessarily, I don't, Marietta beat us, but I don't know if it's so much Marietta beat us or we just gave it to them. You know what I mean? Like, they went out hard from the beginning. You didn't. And then the second half, when you started to close the gap and catch them, you then let them beat you the last half mile. When you lose by one point, again, it's not just, it's not one person's fault, but one point. I think all of you can think back to a time in the race when you either could have made the choice to go with a couple Marietta girls or not go with them. Does that make sense? So learn from this. And if anything, let this teach you that every place matters. Whether it's Marietta or not, I don't care who the person next to you is. Every place matters because one point, two points, whatever. So again, 24 hours. You guys, And I, I told them I'm not going to rip you guys because I know you're hard on yourselves anyway. But do think about this, like let it sting a little bit. Be unless you like seeing Marietta going up and getting a first place trophy, like let it sting a little bit, but then let it use you to motivate you. You guys are fit, we're doing well in training. I did, I did kill you a little bit on Wednesday in the workout. I knew I was going to, so if you're heavy today, I expected that. Um, next week's recovery week. I'm not gonna kill you in training the week of Great American. So it's all a process. But part of that process is you guys need to learn when we don't have a good race. So. Pick something good, pick something bad, but again, shake it off tomorrow, come back Monday and we'll be ready. Today, uh, it's hilly, uh, it's covered in trees so it's shaded which is good. Uh, it's, I mean we love coming out here, uh, cross country's not run on a track so we love the, 
the different terrain that they can run on um, and, and get you know some hill work in. So we'll do some repeats here where it's a little more flat, and then we'll go over to the hill. Uh, but this is kind of a staple, a staple workout in our program. Um, we don't change a lot during the year. Uh, this Wednesday workout stays relatively the same. We'll add some different, uh, just, you know, we'll throw different things at them, whether it's changing the pace, changing the recovery, um, changing the distance every now and then, but we kind of keep it pretty consistent throughout the workout. Um, you know, coming off of getting beat at County by one point by Marietta, we've raced them a couple more times and we've beaten them there. So, you know, we're, we're trending in the right direction heading into region this weekend. Uh, looking to, you know, obviously challenge to win region, um, but that's kind of a side goal. And they always say they can't see the line. Not today. Are you guys hurt? No. I caught myself. Are you hurt? Just, it's because you guys don't pay attention to what you're doing. There's a big root. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. You don't pay attention to what you're doing. You just talk too much. I don't even know what I tripped on. <laughs> I felt it. I laid on the ground like a pancake for a couple seconds. <laughs> <laughs> what do we normally do for rest? Two minutes? Three. What do we normally do? What do we normally do for rest? Two? Uh, yeah, I. Like four. Yeah, we usually. Hello. <laughs> hey, listen up. All right, we're going three to three and a half minutes rest today. Uh, paces aren't going to be crazy fast, but the idea is that with Region, uh, we still get about the same number. Any questions? No, sir. All right, Nino, Brian, and Bo. Let's start at three three forty one which is 128 per 400. What was it? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, let's get, uh, let's get one more there. Spirit Week, and it's probably my favorite week of the season because everyone, like, I don't know, we're just all wearing the same thing, so it's really fun and you feel connected to everyone. And today's Pink Out because October is um, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, which is a good thing to bring awareness for. This of Spirit Week is to, it's just a, a fun way to get us all together, and like, it's the last week of practice before region and it's just a fun last team thing to do towards the end of the season. So um, for me personally, and I've also been trying to encourage some of the other varsity girls to um, think about this too, is trying to like transition from like only focusing on PRs and stuff and more thinking of just like racing, which um, I mean, I can't take credit exactly for that like mental switch because I had to talk to like Sierra and you about it. Um, and I think, you know, I had my best race of the season after I finally made that switch. And so um, I think just, you know, thinking about the race and um, the strategy has been more helpful and it's not been quite as stressful to think about like, oh, I have to PR and I have to hit this time. Um, so that's what I've been trying to encourage everyone to kind of think about um, going in Coach Wood, and then I'll try and reiterate that as we go into region. Region is, it's really important, and I think, like, we would definitely want to win, because we've won there the past two years in a row, and we lost at that same course when we did county earlier this season. We lost to Marietta by one point. So I'd love to come back and have our team um, put it together better than we did at county and um, run just better race and uh, hopefully win. That'd be good.
Uh, both teams going to state, which is good. The girls lost again by one point to Marietta, which is not good, but this is also not the one that matters. So you, you give and take. We beat Marietta here last year, and then they beat us at state. So hopefully we can give them a piece of their own medicine next year. Or next week, two weeks, whenever state is. We're at the county meet. It's like deja vu all over again. In second place with 42 points, first and second were separated by one point. In second place with 42 points, the girls from Hillgrove. You had to lead a step up. So. We, we went from having only five to now having six. That's awesome. Good. Appreciate it. All right, let's go. Come on.